as a piece of pie would. It's nothing. But as two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven parts, you took me from nothing and made me into something. If it's involved with wood, I am involved in it. I'm not an artist. I can't paint, I can't draw, but you give me a piece of wood, I can make some pretty amazing things. My name is David Chamberlain, and I am a Knight of Columbus. We eat together, we pray together, we work together, and if there's something that needs doing, there's always people there. Having the ability to make things, the best part of that is being able to give them away. I talk to the Grand Knight. We have kids who are not going to school anymore. They're studying at home because of the pandemic, and they don't have a place to study. It's important for children to have structure. By not having school, a big part of their structure has been taken away. By having a desk, now it's school time, it's study time. The desks mean hope for the kids, the students. The entire desk, legs, tops, bottoms, are all made of the Baltic birch. 48 desks is 192 legs, rounded over, sanded. <laughs> I think we had 14 or 15 people here. Wilfred and Gary ran the table saw. Each person had their own task. Many hands make light work and all of you can lift the weight that none of you can lift yourself. Yeah, when we're out there, what you're doing is prayer. It feels like progress, because when you're out there, something's happening. And God made it, and it is good. We were giving them out, and the parents were coming with their kids to pick up the desks. That this is just a perfect size. We were one of the first ones in line. To some people, a disc doesn't seem like such a big deal, but it's benefited a lot of children during this COVID crisis. God gives us our gifts, and the idea is not to keep it to ourselves, but to share it with our brothers and sisters. My ultimate hope is that the children can use the desk to help them in this difficult time. Go to the hands of the people who need them. Everyone has a talent. If it's been given to you by God, then it's your duty to share that talent. And to those to whom much is given, much is required. I've been... Sorry. I just give to help people who don't have things they don't have. Jesus said the widow was more blessed because she gave all she had, whereas the Pharisee gave 10% of his income. The best thing to do is to find a local Knights of Columbus and say, I feel a call to help somehow. What can I do? Recognize your talents and share those talents. Starting from a blank, empty piece of plywood and ending up with something that's solid and it's just, you know, priceless. I'm not getting rich monetarily, but I am enriched by the process. You know, these desks may not be the biggest thing in the world, but to the kids, it's something.